Despite EU-wide efforts towards sustainable and clean energy, road transport still accounts for 25% of man-made CO2 emissions. The city of Oslo is no exception. One essential step towards the reduction of urban pollution is Chic, an EU-wide project geared at full market commercialization of fuel cell hydrogen buses, co-financed through a public-private partnership between the European Commission and industry. Hydrogen buses are great. It produces zero emission. And to me, this is the green, clean future for public transport. Hydrogen can be produced by different methods, including by the use of renewable energy. Fuel cells are a bit like batteries, except that they use hydrogen to produce uh, electricity and they only admit water vapour, but unlike batteries, they never run out. So far, the project introduced 26 fuel cell hydrogen buses across five European cities, of which five are circulating in Oslo traffic. Others are also operational in London and Hamburg. Well, the city of Oslo, they are enthusiastic about this. They believe in hydrogen as a necessary part of the future. It's a good thing that we have good trans-regional cooperation so we can learn from each other. And it's also good to have a, the private enterprise and private business together with us in this so that we can together develop this technology. A wide range of industry got on board, such as bus manufacturers Van Hall, Daimler Evo Bus and Wright Bus. Also, spin-off projects speeded ahead, such as High Velocity or this hydrogen station, created through a close collaboration of international companies within this project. The passengers in Oslo is very exciting about the buses. The first they noticed is that the bus is very quiet and uh, they are asking a lot of questions and they are very interesting and very enthusiastic about the project. Until 2015, Chic aims to be the driving engine behind a low-carbon European transport system.